great energy both inside and outside the arena tonight as we are just moments away now from puck drop. The Leafs take possession here on the opening draw, and we are underway. Moves it to Barner. Takes a shot. Comes up for the glove save. Using the net for cover. Receives the pass. Hoffman's got it across the line. Fires it. Glove save by the goalie. Crisp's going to cover it up and get a whistle. Even with the traffic starting to close in, he had to grab that when he did. Johns uses his wheel zone ability, which is his fast skating speed, to create plays. Matthews wins the draw inside his defensive zone. Toronto's got a hold of the puck. Along the wing, up the neutral zone. Handles the puck at the point. Turned aside with the glove by Allen. We often talk about a goalie's reflexes. You've got to have quick hands to make a glove stop like that. The Leafs scoop it up along the boards. Oh, he'd like to have that pass back. Icing is the call. We'll get a face-off at the other end. Jerseys, hats, keychains, you name it. Smartphone cases. They got you covered at the team store. Check them out online, or you can visit it just outside the arena. Open seven days a week. And now it's over to Drouin. Pass broken up. Scooped up along the wall by Doc. Here's a short pass to Matthews. Grabs the puck at center. Matthews setting up against the wall. Can't make the connection on the pass. Quick feed to Marner. Oh, and that's poked away in the offensive zone by Matthews. Moves it quickly over to Riley. Takes the feed. Oh, love the defensive stick work there to poke that one away. Along the half wall with the puck. Shot! Comes up with a stop. Crisp's gonna bounce on it, and he'll take the whistle. He's usually a pretty conservative goaltender anyway, and so the opportunity to kill the play, he's gonna take it. Crisp's great in the butterfly position, guys, and even when he's down, he maintains mobility to move with the play to make the save. That's his butterfly effect zone ability. Scrum ensues along the boards. Grabbed along the board by Voracek. The Canadians gain possession. Centering feed! Bergeron's got it in the offensive end. Here's a shot, and makes the save. Sends the pass over. Dodonov's got it against the boards. Now into the offensive zone from the right side. Makes a move, and the puck hops away from him. Trying just a little bit too much there, foiled on that play. Good battle along the boards for the puck. Now a quick pass to Hall. And it's a quick pass to Taves. Quick shot, and he scores. <laughs> Toronto's hard work in this opening period pays off. Uh, great with the anthem finish. These guys were on it. They've done a really terrific job and are well rewarded for that first goal. Taves wins it in the dots. Quick pass to Hall. Reaches out and uses the stick. The Leafs gain control of the puck against the wall. Nice pass. Intercepted at center by Hall. Toronto's played a really good game here. I like the way that they've checked. They've turned pucks over. Now they want to make something out of all this puck possession. Moves the puck. Here's a shot from point blank. Nice save from point blank range. He's sharp on that one. Nowhere to go for the puck. Slides the pass over to Kessel. From the right wing, he moves into the middle. Taken along the wall by Gostas Bear. Montreal's gain possession along the boards. Taken by Matheson. Dishes it to Byron. Slides the puck into the offensive zone. Moves it to Taves. 
And that's broken up. Manages to hang on. And he makes the save. Allen's gonna opt for the whistle and give everybody a chance to breathe. Sometimes you get running around as the shift gets long. This helps. More than half the period has gone by. Hope you're enjoying this one. The Leafs lead it 1-0. The Canadians take possession off the faceoff. Montreal's got it in their own zone. Into the attacking area from the left side. The Leafs gain possession in their own end. Carries it across the line. Puck scooped up by Cooley. Gaining momentum up along the side. Takes the feed. Toronto's moving it up the ice. Puck goes out of play. We got a faceoff coming up. The Leafs have never really had a bad stretch this season. They've played well, they've played consistently, and when you look at their position in the standings, it shows you pretty much that this is the league's best team. Nice job tying up his opponent. From the left side, takes it at center. Here's a short pass to Johns. And that's blocked in traffic. Big save in front. High quality chance, high quality save. Pass. Back to the point. Oh, look at this. They are really starting to apply the pressure now. And they'll end all that pressure as they clear the zone. Toronto's got the puck. Slides the cross ice pass. Almost lost the puck, but hangs on here as play continues. And now it's grabbed by Suzuki. Montreal's got him along the wall. Gets the puck over to Matthews. Toronto's crossed the line and on the attack. Montreal's got the puck in their own end. Fires it into the offensive zone. Along the boards, they battle for the puck back and forth. Voracek's got it through center. The Leafs carry it along the wall. Sends the pass down low. And sends it just out of reach. Puck set across the blue line. And a great read to turn that play aside. Montreal gained the line and into the zone. And that goes off course off a of body. Picked up along the wall by Doc. Feeds it over to Fowler. Coached away at center by Anderson. First period almost in the books here, nearing the final 60 seconds. The Canadiens going to use that one, trailing in this game. A bad break hits the post and stays out. Bergeron's got it in the offensive zone. Slides it across to Gallagher. Quick feed to Edmondson. Long reach breaks up the momentum. And that'll put a bow on the first 20 minutes of action here tonight. We've got lots more still to come. Second period is just around the corner. A clean sheet of ice beckons, and period number two set to get underway. The second stanza is underway as the puck is dropped. Let's go. One period already in the books. Ray, how have you seen this thing? Montreal's got to find another gear or two or three here. They've been behind almost all night. They haven't had the puck very much. As a result, they're behind on the board as well. Couldn't complete the play. Handles it along the blue line. Under siege and finally grabs that one and covers up for a whistle. Lots of time left in this period. one nothing the score. Matthews has won the draw. Oh, he had the right idea but couldn't make that play with the pass. Puts it off and Allen's gonna smother it to get a whistle. Can get dangerous if nobody's in control of the puck. Marner's hockey IQ makes him an effective playmaker, guys. He's able to complete difficult passes and find his teammates with a solid dish. That's his third eye zone ability, and it's something to watch out for. And he slides it quickly to Marner. Hammers a shot. 
and that carries off a body in traffic. Feeds the puck to Caulfield, and he coughs it up with the pass. Oh, denies him with the paddle save. Pass to Caulfield. Toronto's got possession here in the neutral zone. Oh, they couldn't connect on the Whoa. play. Scores! Mitch Marner! Toronto's now gone up by a pair in the second. So they've got a two-goal lead. Some people say it's the worst lead in hockey. Well, guess what? I'll take the worst lead as opposed to trailing by two. Yeah, you know what's better than down by two? Being up by two, of right? Of course it Simple. is. Simple. And a solid job tying up his opponent. Moves it quickly over to Bergeron. Oh, what a stop with the paddle. Read of the play was perfect, but it's his quickness that gets out tight to the puck so the shooter can't elevate it anywhere. There's nowhere for the puck to go. Teams are lined up, and we are ready to take this draw. Back underway as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. And he takes the dish. Takes a shot. Close save. Chris is going to hang on here for the whistle and stoppage of play. It's a good thing he does because you haven't mentioned his name and I don't know how long the play's been at the other end of the ice forever. Still plenty of time left in this frame. The Leafs have all the momentum right now, leading by two. Quick pass to Edmondson. Takes the feet at the back end. Moves it to Doc. Turns it away. They are really feeling it now here in the Ozone. Center, what a performance to this point. They've moved the puck so well that they've had the puck the whole night. Their opponents are chasing it around like a carrot on a stick. Fires it into the offensive zone. Toronto's got a hold of it along the wall. Puck picked up by Hall. Breakaway! Can't find his man. And he can't get the shot off! Uh, I hope he's not waiting for a better chance to shoot the puck. I mean, it is a breakaway, but he ends up screwing himself into the ice and not getting anything on the net. Great reach with the poke check by Latang. Toronto's looking to break out of their own end. Now over to Hall. Here they come up along the wing. Takes the pass. Toronto's on the attack. Tries to the crease. And there's the save. A spirited battle along the boards for the puck. Dvorak's picking up steam. Here's a chance. And that's broken up with a stick in front. He almost lost it for a second there, but regains control of the puck. From the right side, they gain the zone. Centering to the middle. A blast. And that's stopped by the goaltender using his head this time. I like the way he tracks the puck where he's got to find it, and then he gets his body right in front of it. That's a good save. Gaining speed through center, and here they come on the attack. Toronto's got the puck inside the defensive zone. Gaining momentum along the wing. Slides it out front, and that doesn't connect. Montreal's got the puck. They've got numbers here. A chance out front. And that stopped. Crisps on top of that for the whistle. Pretty quickly on top of it to kill the play. Suzuki's on the edge. For this offensive zone faceoff, and he's going to have to lead this team, James, offensively if they have any hope of getting back in this game. The Leafs get a hold of the puck in their own end. Up the neutral zone now. In the offensive zone with the puck. You know he's thinking about his next milestone that's sitting one goal away. 
Knocked away by Hoffman. Moves it to the middle. And that's covered up for the whistle. And a much needed face off will give them a breather. James and Ray with you tonight. More than half the period has been played. Toronto's got a 3 0 lead. They have been in control right from the start. Oh, and he takes possession of the puck from off the wing with the centers all locked up there off the draw. Slides it back to the blue line. Here's a short pass to Suzuki. And that's blocked from someone in front. The Leafs take it across the line. Sends it over to Suzuki. Up along the wall on the right side and into the attacking area. Puck grabbed by Matthews. The Canadians look to start the transition game. Montreal's limping towards the second intermission here. They've got to get into the dressing room and see if they can find a new way to play. Jumps the puck in. Montreal's got possession of the puck. Drouet's got the puck along the wing. Quick feed to Doc. Good reach of the stick to knock the puck away. Nice feed. The Canadians get a hold of it. Poked away in the neutral zone by Segris. Keeps hold of the puck. Picked up along the boards by Anderson. And now he moves it quickly to Voracek. Poked away at center by Edmondson. Here's a chance. Walker stopped by Allen. Denies him again. Stop one, stop two. The goalie makes a couple of excellent saves. Slides the puck over. And that's broken up. Oh, what a stop as he uses his paddle to sweat it away. Crisp's had a good seat for most of this offensive explosion. They're winning by a pile, and he hasn't had much to do. Here. In the late goings of the period, Toronto's on easy street right now. They lead it 3 0. And tries to make a diagonal pass to Shekai. And he stands tall in goal. Both centers ready to take the draw here coming up. Caves takes possession right off the draw. And he takes the pass. Oh, he got a little sliver of it, and it stays out. Less than a minute to go here in the second. Moves it quickly over to Fowler. Oh, and that's poked away in the offensive zone by Caves. Through the neutral zone, moving the puck along the side. Quick pass to Byron. And that goes off someone in front and doesn't reach the net. Sends a pass over. And there's the buzzer bringing the second period to an end. You don't want to go home yet, do you? Third period action still to come. Welcome back, James Sabolski, ready to bring you all the play-by-play. -play. Here we go, third period set to get underway. Simply too much to not enough at this point. You know you love to hear Ray Ferraro's takes, and he is between ice level with his assessment of the first two periods. Montreal's been a step slow almost all game. They haven't had the puck very much. They're losing. If that's going to change, they've got to get the puck and hold on to it much more. The Canadians gain possession along the wall. They're looking to make something happen through the neutral zone now. Scooped up along the wall by Caulfield. Stays with it. Moves it to Suzuki. And they keep the pressure on. Takes that pass back at the point. Let's it fly. Zero fear on this guy's part as he blocks it. Moves the puck along the half wall. And it's kicked away. Moves it to the middle, and he denies that great opportunity there. Here's a short pass to Suzuki. With possession along the wall. Handles the pass. Shot, and that goes off a player. 
Slides it quickly to Drouet. The Canadians played along the wing. Huge steal at his own end. Toronto's had great stick positioning for most of the night. They don't have the puck. They get it back really quickly. On the attack into the offensive end, right up the gut. Now he takes it over the line. Shot, makes the save. Allen's on top of the puck, and that'll stop the play. Pretty conservative play here, James, as he covers it up to kill the play. We haven't even hit the midway mark of the period. The Leafs are in cruise control, leading it 3-0. Zegers has got possession. Let's see what they can do with it now. Whoa! Scores! Oh, what a shot on the one-timer! Toronto's having a lot of fun out there tonight, but Ray, I can imagine it's a different story on the other side of the bench. Yeah, half the guys out here are having fun. The other half, this game can't end quick enough. The Canadians win the faceoff. And takes a tour out of the offensive end to find some space at center. Along the boards, they battle for the puck. The Leafs have it against the wall. Feeds it across the ice to Voracek. The Leafs are in transition. Centering pass! Takes a shot! Tremendous read as he pokes it away with the paddle. Sends it out in front! Oh, and he comes up with a stop! And now he moves it to Dvorak. Handles the puck. Taken by Gallagher. The Leafs grab possession to the puck. Picking up steam in the offensive zone. Montreal grabbed a hold of the puck. Along the side, here they come through the neutral zone. And skilled use of the stick to poke the puck away. Up along the wing. Moves it to the middle. Can't connect the play. Quick feed to Edmondson. And he takes the feed. Sends the pass in front. And he shuts down a great scoring chance there. Some last-second communication before both teams get ready to drop the puck here. Montreal's got it, and they're on the attack. Denies him in front. He swallows that puck up as he slides across in the butterfly to make the save. Cuts into the paint. Poked away in the offensive zone by Taves. Toronto's working on this shutout mainly because they played most of the game in the other team's end. A great offense is the best defense. The Leafs are on the schedule for the next day here. Yeah, it's fine for us to look ahead, but you really can't do that. You still got to finish the job at hand. Well past the midway mark of this period, this has been a lopsided affair. 4 nothing is where we're sitting. Moves it quickly over to Shekai. Grabs him with the glove. Good save. Positional save through traffic. Poked away in the neutral zone by Shekai. Looking to make something happen along the boards. Puck scooped up by Shekai. Through the neutral zone up along the wing. And he regains control of the puck. Puts it on net. Oh, what a stop! Crisps on top of that one for a whistle. Little bit of traffic starting to form around the net. The Canadians win the faceoff. It puts it just wide. The goalie was late reacting. If that puck hits the net, I think it's in. The Leafs move the puck in the defensive zone. Quick pass to Johns. Looks to pass it to Doc. Streaking through center, they go on the attack. And now it's grabbed by Doc. And that pass doesn't go. And he slides it quickly to Matheson in front of it for the block. Grabbed along the boards by Matthews. Oh, what a chance here. Can they make it happen on this two-on-one? The Canadians take it along the wing. Docks exploring options with the puck. Gets it over to Johns. Steps inside the attacking zone down the left wing. That's gloved by Allen. 
covers it up and we'll get a stoppage in play. Standing by with her thoughts on who had the edge tonight, it's our own Carlin Bade. Johns came to play, and even though he hasn't recorded a point, guys, I still think he's been engaged in this game. I'm giving him my vote here. Moves it to Johns. From one point man to another. Denied by Allen. The most fun save for the goaltender, the glove stop. Here's a short pass to Caulfield. And he makes the save. Fine. Taken along the wall by Hoffman. Savard's got it along the wing. Now a quick pass to Matheson. My goodness, this has been a pressure-filled shift here. Oh, what a stop on the play! Crisp's gonna hang on to that one for a whistle. Quickly on top of that, James, he needed a cover there. Late goings of this period. The Leafs lead it 4-0. They have dominated. Montreal's won the draw, and they'll go to work. And that goes off a body. Sends it into the offensive zone. The Canadians get a hold of the puck along the boards. Looking for space inside the D zone. Montreal's through center and now in the offensive end. Here's a chance, a two on one. Quick pass to Gallagher. Montreal's got the puck along the wall. Whoa. He scores! Perfect timing. Well, they was trying to get through, break through on this goaltender who's been run in the shadow. Finally, they get one. The Canadians have a long way to go still here in the third. I guess you get your scores out there and you try and keep climbing out of a hole, but it's not very pretty right now. Camps won the draw inside the neutral zone. Nearing the final 60 seconds in this one. Here's a shot, and he gets just enough of it to keep it out for the back of the net. Both teams are set. They're ready to drop the puck. Seekers has it in their own end. And he takes the feed. Passes on over to Voracek. Montreal's got control of it now from their own end. Through the open ice, they're picking up steam. Toronto's gained possession. Good fight for the puck along the boards. Cuts to the front. Scores! And with that, there's number 200 in the point career. You're starting to expect him to score. That's a nice round number at 200 at this point of his career. The Canadians still have a big hill to climb here, but they got one back, Ray. They're going to have to get their D up into the plate, take a couple of chances. One is not going to do it. Puck is dropped, and we are back underway. Montreal got it in the offensive zone. The Canadians have pulled the goaltender here. They've got the extra attacker out on the ice in hopes of a goal. Montreal has got a hold of it against the wall. To Caulfield. And that's deflected off someone in front. The Leafs will play it from the defensive zone. Moves it quickly over to Caulfield. And we are all over with this one tonight. Coming into this game, this team was really confident. So to suspect another win probably wasn't a stretch for them. They extend the streak. Well, the way they're playing, it looks like that streak's not going to show an end anytime soon. That'll do it for tonight's broadcast. For Ray Carlin, I'm James. See you next time.